Worcester to Boston, down toward Providence, all flash flood warnings for us tonight. And keep in mind, all these places uh, got a blow from uh, Tropical Storm Henri when it came in last weekend. Uh, Kent, Providence, Washington counties under flash flood warnings. So you name it, the county, uh, you name a single county in the Northeast, truly everyone between Boston and Philadelphia has a flash flood warning or a flash flood emergency. I have never in my career seen anything quite like it. The most heavily populated corridor in all of America has got insane weather going on tonight. You can see the weather starting to back off for us a little bit in Philadelphia, but we still have a flash flood warning in effect. Uh, Colleen, it's mind-blowing what is going on right now. I mean, I could use so many adjectives right now, but think about this. Truly, from Philadelphia to Boston and every county in between, there's a flash flood warning. Yeah, and uh, wow, this is ongoing for so uh, for so many more hours into tonight. Uh, just an unprecedented situation. And here's what we know, Mike, so far right now about the flood threat in the Northeast. The governor of New Jersey declared a state of emergency effective immediately. The Metropolitan Transit Authority has suspended all subway service in New York at Newark Airport. They're diverting passengers away from ground level areas where the flood water is starting to creep in. At this hour, 16 million of you are under some kind of flood alert. And of course, all of this related to Ida and the remnants of Ida. I want to give you some of those 